Hello and welcome everyone back to Poke Play Pokemon Y. Trouble is afoot. It seems that Team Flare has tried to infiltrate the glowing cave. But fear not, because we have the power of disaster on our side, which is just absolutely making their life a living nightmare. So right away, we are going to heal up disaster. He deserves it the most. And you know what? He gets the HP up too, because that's how it works. And I know, actually, HP might be something you would realistically give if you were EV training him. EV training is just not something I'm doing in this playthrough. This game is easy enough as is, but it is something I do uh, in my own time. EV and IV training now that it's actually possible. I'm gonna break some rocks with Rock Smash. I've been told you can find the old amber in here. I did not find it in my initial playthrough. I don't know if it's a random drop or a specific rock, but I mean, if there are rocks, I will smash. I will not meet other players though. I'm just playing by myself. Like lonely old man. Um, <clears throat> Pancham to the rescue. Oh, we found our first rock Pokemon. This is a feature I'm not super excited about. Like, it's cool. Ooh, yeah, Dwebble. I don't have him, um, but eventually it's... Oh, wait, I do have him, apparently. Sorry, Dwebble. You lost your privileges. I don't know. I must have caught you earlier. It's just like the same two Pokemon over and over again. Isn't it funny how he tried to surprise me, but I am not in any fathom leeway pass I'm not even talking I don't know I just want to destroy him with onyx that's all we need to say about to become a disaster I wish he had ground type moves as well but it's just a bunch of rocks doesn't matter every time oh yeah your speed did fall that was embarrassing oh did I just get poisoned lame All right, so one by one, um, actually, Rage does sort of interest me. Um, nah, three Rock Tombs should do it. <sighs> so slow, you could probably barely walk at this point. And what, your special defense gonna save you? Actually, <laughs> is Rock Tomb special based? It might be. Nope, physical. So guess what? You're about to get stoned. Boom. Feels good, man, doesn't it? Now get out of here. Disaster MVP. Although this poison is pretty awful. Electric? Yeah, rocks to the face sounds good. Yeah, I really need to add a ground type move to him. Would help quite a bit. Although he's going to die in two rocks. And he made the horrific mistake of trying to lower my defense. I'm sorry, but your rock-based death will be terrifying. Boom. This won't ever get old for me. Until he gets bad. I mean, he is poisoned. He might need to be switched out. Uh, thank goodness you no longer... Yeah, Baikai can learn Quick Attack. It's not good, but you can learn it. Actually, these are, like, not horrible moves, all things considered. Get rid of Tail Whip. Surprised he doesn't know Tackle or some other basic move like that. Sweet. But yeah, thank goodness there is no longer field damage for Poison. Um, I would have to run all the way back to the entrance and heal again. I'm not really super interested in doing that. I would like to plow through the rest of the cave. That said, I don't know if I have a... Oh, I do have antidotes. Sweet. I've got four antidotes. They've just been giving them away for free. So, uh, <laughs> Disaster can continue his run. Nothing stopping him. Uh, any good TMs? Return isn't horrible if his friendship grows. The more he's in the front of the party, that'll happen. Return might be good for a lot of my Pokemon. I'm not 100% sure. As far as anything else, Protect is, like... Great. Rock smash. No. All right. We just got to wait it out. The good moves will come. Pancham the slave uncovers. Watch well, it should be another Dwebble. It's like 100 Dwebbles in these rocks. Yep. Boring. I do love that he comes out first uh, that he comes out screaming. He just sounds completely pissed when he comes out 
that's the right attitude I would argue to have uh, if you're gonna destroy a nation. Oh no, I didn't see the shadow. I totally think I could have avoided that. Um, two, I just love that he's coming out of the luxury ball. Just makes him look pretty amazing. Also, I hate Woobat. In fact, if Woobat gets knocked out with this rock throw, I'm not even going to be in the slightest upset. Whoops, my bad. Oh man, now I have to catch him. Hate Woobat, hate everything about him. Stupid heart face, stupid name that rhymes with Zubat. Uh, stupid not being caught. All right, we're gonna do this the right way. How's it going, Hayne? How's it been? I understand you might be a little bit jealous, no longer being in the limelight. It's okay. Um, your day will come. Now go to sleep. Oh, as my system lags, it's great. <laughs> the problem is uh, I'm not recording to a uh, external drive. It's something you have to do. Fraps takes up a lot of your space. Um, well, you know, my frame rate jumped back up. Maybe we are okay. Nah, nah, we, we be lagging. I got to fix this. Stupid Woobat ruining everything. All right, uh, I believe we have alleviated ourselves from the great Woobat lag disaster. Thanks a lot, Woobat. And now where we go? Nothing in that rock. Oh, I see how it is. You want to play on fair, two on one. Well, guess what? I have a friend. No, I'm not ready to team up. We need to, I need to get out of here. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm absolutely ready. Are you kidding? Oh, I did not even mean to press the B button there. Actually, <laughs> as much as I love disaster, um, I do want to hit both of them at the same time with flower power. That seems appropriate. So let's go ahead and do that. Now I'm ready. I love how Team Flare, they're like, okay, with just waiting. They're like, oh, well, well, we can't attack now. We gotta wait for him to be ready. Heaven forbid we'd attack if he wasn't ready. All right, so. I don't know exactly how good this double Razor Leaf is gonna be, but you know what? Life is all about surprises. Check out that light screen. You know how I said uh, life is all about <laughs> critical. Hmm. So uh, this whole thing about life and surprises, eh? Um. All right. We need to have a talk. Everyone. He just got Moxie boosted, which is terrifying. Um, both of them have fighting subsets, which is going to knock out Absol. We need to narrow our efforts here and uh, try and get Scraggy on its weakness. Well, Absol gets the critical hit over there. In theory, this should be really, really good. Oh, it was, but it just wasn't really, really good enough. Oh, and that's going to be... Well, it's supposed to be bad, but Poison Sting is just an awful all-around attack. Oh, that's going to be horrible. I'm sorry, Absol. I think it's just up to me. I don't think she has any other Pokemon. Oh, he gets another Moxie boost. Yeah, we need to... We need to ruin this threat before... Horrible, horrible... Oh, no, she's got Quilliadin, too. So this really is an extremely easy battle. Hey, it's her Pokemon that are being knocked out, not mine. Uh, Razor Leaf, even though it's bad, will clear out Scraggy. No, don't attack Scraggy! Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Now we're not we're not knocking out Krogunk this turn. Way to go, Quilladin. Big fatty. Absolute failure. You deserve that poison sting. You brought that upon yourself. You should know better. All right, so finally, a leech seed. How slow do you want this battle to be? Fairy wind's gonna be great. It doesn't matter. Ah, jeez. No wonder you're my rival. 
Kane wants to learn Bullet Seed. Woo! Uh, it's gonna be better than Fairy Wind, which does not hit for same type. It's still not gonna be good, but uh, yeah. Hayden's by no means going to be an offensive Pokemon, but I'll take what I can get. Yeah, that's what you get. You better go cry. Go away. All right, Flower Power took a beating. Disaster back at the forefront. Breaking boulders, hoping to get something good. Boo. How about you? I'll tell you, I'll tell you anything really. Anything other than a Pokemon. I said other. It's going to be another Dwebble because this game is ridiculous. Come on. It's like the only rock type you can... I think you can actually find Onyx in them sometimes. Ugh. No, I don't want another Dwebble. I barely want the first one. And by barely, I mean don't want the first one. Boom. Anything. Another Pokemon. What goody can we get here? Yep, there's the Onyx. I'd honestly stop breaking them if there weren't good things in the rocks sometimes. You couldn't get away! Couldn't get away! I am by far this Onyx is superior! Now stop that nonsense! Let me leave! Yay, escape rope, which I will shortly be using after I bust this rock. It's time to make the choice. And my goodness, you guys have been frightening uh, when it comes to which fossil team you're on. I have never seen a more even split in my audience when it comes to making a decision. Now, I've already made my decision beforehand. I'm just letting you guys know, I do have the jaw fossil in my X game, so I'm getting the sail fossil. However, I find it very interesting how uh, absolutely dedicated you guys are to each fossil team. So, uh, Team Sail Fossil, you've won this round. Um, it just Ice Pokemon sounds good. I don't have one. I've already got Part Rock going on here. Um, I don't have any dragons, no. But, um, it's just the way it's gonna be. We found the assistant and found that suspicious group called Team Flair as well. I guess I should train more so that I don't get destroyed by a stupid Krogunk and Scraggy. Come on. All right. So how about you, Rock? Are you the one with the old Amber in it? No. I don't know if it's a random drop or what. Uh, I'm, I'm getting out of here. We've had our fun. I just looked at my Pokemon as if one of them had Dig. Let's try this one more time. And not look in the TMs. Oh, and the escape rope doesn't go to the bottom because I have other escape ropes. There we go. Out we go. And the best part about this is we get to ride the Onyx again, which is by all means not the best part. I don't want to do this. This is why I bought the repels. Let us get out of here. Repel, 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 repel. I am so bad at navigating this menu. Here we go. Spray it. And pray it that we do not run into any Pokemon because sometimes the repel is not foolproof. But these rocks are not Rhyhorn proof. Uh, back we go. It's funny. I've been waiting for the day where I could ride a Pokemon for so long. I just didn't expect it to be this sluggish and painful. You think uh, when my mom rides her Rhyhorn that it goes this fast? I can run faster than that on foot. I also really hate riding the uh, Mamo Swine that you find later. It's it's just as clunky. Fortunately, but there's this one Skidoo that's an absolute pleasure to ride. Can't wait to find him. See you, Rhyhorn. You did good. Oh, Repel's effect wore off. Nope. It provided exactly its purpose. 
And now we can finally cut through the aquarium. I'm gonna go ahead and heal my team. And beat up some swimmers. Sounds good to me. Oh! Actually, before I go, I need to I need to get my fossil to uh fossil man. Because in theory, this world just says the technology where you can give them a fossil and they can just straight up convert that into a living being. Don't ask me how the technology works. It's kind of... Oh, actually, this is not where I need to go. This is one of the smallest towns in the entire game. I have no idea how I get lost. Here's where I want to go. Oh, I don't have any garbage balls. If I did, I'd trade you for another dive ball. So, let's do this. Just straight up, you give him a fossil, and he restores it. I don't exactly know what the art of restoration is, but... Ta-da! He just gives you an Amora. I can't argue with that whatsoever. So I am all for this Ice Ice Baby joining my team. Let's see. Over at box one. I think they're level 20. Yeah, um... I'm totally okay with you joining the team. The problem is someone's got to move. Um, hmm. Well, well now. I was thinking like, oh, maybe Flappire's level 20. You can move him. No. I guess for now, um, I'd rather have the ice than the Boktai. Sorry, Boktai. I'll put you here for consideration. But, I mean, I don't know. Not that good. Whereas you have got this... Oh, you're rock too. I forgot. Eh. Doesn't matter. I I want Amara. No regrets. You'll get a nickname later once you get fly and can easily navigate back. No regrets. All right. I think that's the end of this business here. Somebody in here talks about how like um oh he just gives you Aerodactylite. Forgot about that. Uh, but he's he's like you can find old amber sometimes when you break a rock with rock smash. I guess I was not part of one of those times. And I am in no mood to sit around farming it if I need to. I can't complete a wonder trade because I'm not connected online. I hate these notifications. So out through the aquarium and into the cold, harsh world. And by that I mean like the world for everyone else who has to experience my onyx. Uh, my world is great. Their world is cold and harsh. Actually, with all these water types, things might get a little bit ugly. We shall see. So, um, is there a berry in here? Nope. Already claimed it. Once a week. Bring it on, swimsuit woman. Oh, she gives you the dowsing machine. She ended up finding her lost thing with it. The dowsing machine's actually a lot of fun. Um, I guess people who use the dowsing machine are called dowsers. Sweet. Well, I'm about to become a dowser myself. It's kind of fun. Um, I won't lie. And we will register it as well. So, um, whoop, wrong button. Let's douse. It has different colors the closer you get to, um, items. I'm also not very good. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. <laughs> Found an ultra ball. Woo! So it, uh, yeah, it, it makes bigger noises and freaks out more the closer you get to cool stuff. Oh. Come on. <laughs> oh, found a heart scale. Cool. Um, was, you can use it just about everywhere. I honestly don't use it as much as I should. Oh, oh. I hate that sometimes it just disappears, though. It should just be like a hot and cold thing. Oh, wait. See, it's like here. It's yellow. Stardust. Sweet. You can sell that. Um, so, yeah, there's all kinds of stuff littered across here. As... Absolutely thrilling it is, I'm sure, to just watch me running around here trying to play Metal Detector. Um, oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> wait. <laughs> I heard it make the good sound. <laughs> wait. Here. Pearl. Sweet. You can sell all that stuff. It's good stuff. Uh, as thrilling as that is, I mean, I'll keep it on hand while I run. Um... Pretty sure it's time to move on, beat up some swimmers. Also, if they have water type Pokemon, I made the wrong switch in taking Boktai out. 
All right, Genevieve. Oh, Wingle, awesome. Part flying type, that's all I wanted to see. Rocks to the face, no regrets. You know, it really is appropriate that they call this attack Rock Tomb. Because it is your tomb! Love it. Absolutely love it. Now give me a give me a different typing attack. That would be sweet. Rock polish. That is not what I wanted to know. Increases my speeds? Do not care. Yes, give up. I seem to be faster than people for the most part anyway. Onyx is fairly fast for a giant snake made of rocks. Alright, here comes Psyduck. Here's where we could have some problems. I do not like water. Um, trying to look. I have any psychic, any bug, any dark. None of those things. I mean, Jack Black could have dark typing someday. I'm going to give... Oh, uh, that could be a problem. I want to give Amora a shot. Hmm. I think uh, Joan of Arc should be okay here. Actually, I, I've, I should have a ghost attack here. I think I might have said Psychic instead of Ghost. I don't know what I'm saying. But uh, I, I've got that Shadow Claw I've never used that should be pretty awesome here. Yeah, that Water Pulse would have been bad. Oh, still not that good for me. Shadow Claw is where it's at. And where it's at, I mean, that was still pretty embarrassingly bad. Um, we need to regroup here. I guess Psyduck does not have the Psychic typing yet. Um... So now that I know it's water, I should have just been coming in with Razor Leaf. I don't know. It's an off day, guys. Certainly an off day. And it, I really, it looks like Flower Power does not get the grass secondary typing until it fully evolves, um, which is kind of sad. I mean, I'm cool with the Razor Leafs I've got now. But it does leave a little bit to be desired. Jack Black, level 20. He wants to learn Slash. <laughs> Isn't that cute? He wants to actually learn moves for himself. Um, only because we have Karate Chop and Arm Thrust, I'll give you a new one. But I I'm sorry, Jack. You are HM Slave of the Year. How do you like that, Genevieve? You are a poor swimmer. Alright, we'll take out one more person then call it a day here. Actually, this guy might... Oh yeah, he's got fish. I mean, that's, that should just go without saying here. And Flower Power seems to be the ideal person to take on this crew. Still feel a little bit guilty. Baktai could probably afford to come back into the team. Um, I might go back and grab him before the next episode. Or before the next episode starts. Because I could use some electricity here. Not going to lie. Until then, uh, this is not good. Yeah, he's got the, the part poison typing, I'm pretty sure, which is really bad for me all around. I have the Rocky helmet that I completely forgot about, though, and so uh, this should still be a, a two-hit knockout. I should have done Fairy Wind instead. Now it wouldn't have been that good either if he's got the poison. Either way, the Rocky helmet will do the rest of the work. Can't argue there. That's why I gave it to you. And, oh, another tentacle. Oh, good, good. I did want to continually do this same battle over and over again. Um, try to look at Fairy Wind, 40, Razor Leaf, 55. Yeah, the way the math goes, Razor Leaf is just the better... Better move. Oh, what is this? This tentacle's built of some completely different moral fiber here. I mean, we'll still... No, maybe the Rocky Helmet's just doing a lot more damage than I'd expect. It's taking, it's doing almost as much as the Razor Leaf itself. Also, Boo Acid. Um, it's quote unquote super effective. It's still not good. But he doesn't get the Rocky Helmet when he doesn't hit me physically. Doesn't matter, we got the leaves here. I think Boktai has earned his place though. Seeing how bad I am against these triple tentacles. Uh... Just hope he keeps hitting with Constrict, because that, um, no, no, not Bubble Beam. No, not Bubble Beam. Oh, man. All right. Someone else has to do some work here. I'm going to give Amora a shot, even though it's not super ideal. Just check him out. 
Never used him for anything. Um, yep, gonna get out of the bubble beam. This is gonna be horrendous. Almost knocked me out. It's okay, because uh, I want to try some new things. Aurora beam, 65. That's a pretty good move to start with. Icy wind. Let's just try Aurora beam. It's not gonna be great. It's probably gonna have an awesome animation, though, and... I just want to see what it looks like. I'm surprised. That is surprisingly not good. It's worse than the animation I've seen for uh, the one in Coliseum. Makes me kind of sad. Oh no, takedown was a bad choice. We're both going down. <laughs> uh, now everyone who told me, they're like, oh, I told you, you should have got the jaw fossil or whatever Tyrant's fossil is called. Um, yeah, we're gonna go back to the Pokemon Center and regroup here. That was just my own stupidity of bringing him into someone who had weakness. Just wanted to try somebody new. Anyway, as always, thank you guys for watching Pokemon Y. I know today was not the most fruitful episode, but next time, uh, I'm sure exciting things will happen. I just realized, am I still holding the tossing machine? <laughs> it's cool you can run with it, just look kind of silly. Anyway, see you guys next time.